let's do a get ready with me with fun facts about myself. So I actually did this about a year ago and I think it's time to recreate it because it's my birthday so there is literally no better time to do this. Today I'm just going to do my birthday makeup because I'm going to be taking pictures all day and I'm okay with that and we're going to do that so well, I guess yeah that's pretty much it. Anyway to the fun part, today is my birthday, I turned 18 and I am super excited because honestly, I did not think I'd make it this far, but I did, so whatever. I have some friends over that came over from the US and they're staying with us for a while, which is super exciting. They're literally like my best friends, like cousins, honestly, which is honestly just super exciting. I'm just hanging out with them, probably gonna do something, not sure. I got a bunch of new makeup brushes and I'm super excited to try them. I'm excited to try this one, which is like a foundation brush. So, oh wait. Anyway, enough of me bragging about my makeup brushes. Some more facts about me. I was born in Italy. Mom just called me. Anyways, what was I saying? Anyways, I had to watch that back because I cannot remember what I said. Anyways, I was born in Italy, Milan which honestly kind of makes sense for my fashion and everything. And when I was seven years old, I moved down to Chile. Chile, I don't know, however you want to pronounce that. And lived there for two years. And once I moved here in Canada, I, I don't know, I just continued my life. Obviously with that came a lot of trouble because having to learn three completely different languages is not easy by the end by like by the age of 10 it's it's trouble and because i was moved around all the time i did not really have stable friend groups which made it really hard on the long run trying to make friends and communicating especially with a language barrier but i got through it also about that because of my language barrier i was made fun of a lot and got bullied constantly because of my languages which looking back is kind of ridiculous because I mean, that, that's pretty badass but obviously me at the time did not realize that or think that and really put myself down for that so anyway after that like after years of having to learn everything and new language and like making and building my friend group pretty much again i started high school and that was a whole different story. Go to part two.